Hey everybody, it's One Cool Blurred answering the Ask One Cool Blurred question. How can I hack LinkedIn to get the job that I want? We're gonna get right into it. So the first thing that you need to do is understand that LinkedIn is a keyword or search engine based social network. So you would use search engine optimization techniques similar to how you would for to make sure that Google ranks your website higher, but you would do it for your resume. So the first thing you'd want to do is make sure that your resume makes a lot of sense. And then when you put it on LinkedIn, make sure that you're using the language of the jobs that you want to be pulled up for. You mentioned and you've actually filled in the skills and check those off and that each job experience uses keywords and stresses um, how you've either made a company money, how you save them money, or how you save them time, which is the same as saving them money. The other thing that you can do is post videos, blogs, and content, reshare things, curate, and be very serious about that content that you share so that you could become uh, an established authority or influencer in your space. The third thing that you're going to want to do is use your search, the search engine f yourself. If you have a goal of working at, um, uh, let's say, let's call it a Megacorp. If you have a goal of working at Meta Megacorp and you know that you want to work at Meta Megacorp as a data scientist, then you go on LinkedIn and you use the search engine to search megacorp and title of um data scientist data analytics or head of and then you find everyone and you look under the people's tab everyone that comes up in that department you go on their page of course this is after you've made sure your linkedin is squared away and you can hit me up for tips on how to make sure that your linkedin is optimized to make people click and check it out just even from your headline and name. And you just start to engage with those people. Here's the thing. People on LinkedIn generally only have people that they have done business with or know come on their LinkedIn if they're not an influencer. So when you go to a company like Megacorp, you might not be able to get to the CTO. But Billy, who just started working there a year ago, you click on his page and start looking at his stuff and engaging with him, he's going to have fewer people on his page. And so he's going to actually pay attention to the content you're sharing. He's going to value that conversation and you'll be adding value. So then when you reach out and you do that for Jimmy at who might be his first year there, and you do the same thing with the head of the data analytics department. These people will have smaller pools, and you just kind of pop up and give value and learn and talk and see what they like and communicate with them. And then after you're building a relationship, just, hey, is there an opening? Or I already put my application in, and when they see your name, they'll be like, oh, man, I remember uh, that young man or that young lady. And so you're able to target these jobs in a way where you kind of force the real people that you want to get to to become aware of your brand and the value you can add for them. So that is how you can actually go ahead and hack LinkedIn to get the job that you want. There are several other hacks, but that's the one that we're sharing for today. Okay, I'm One Cool Blurred answering the Ask One Cool Blurred question of how can I hack LinkedIn to get the job that I want?